As a man, it's so important to have a self-care routine. I think if more men took care of themselves in the morning, in a short 10-minute period, you, not only would you feel as confident as possible, all your stress, anxiety would go away, but more importantly, you would feel as attractive as possible. And I'm gonna show you my exact 10-minute routine every man should deploy, starting with number one, step in the shower. Don't be the dude that showers at night and not have to sh wake up early and not shower in the morning. You smell musty, bro. People can smell it on you that you didn't shower that morning. Get your ass up early, get in the shower. I like to use a silicone scrubber here instead of a loofah or a towel because these scrubbers have better bristles that do an amazing job at really exfoliating the skin, lifting up that dead skin, clearing out the pores, and with a good body wash, you end up smelling amazing while also leaving your skin ultra soft because you just exfoliated it. This takes me to number two. Step two is shampoo and condition. Right? Even as a dude with shorter hair, you should always shampoo and condition. Don't just use a cheap bar soap. The shampoo is great at just removing all the dirt, all the funk, because again, even with short hair, you have to wash it because it's gonna smell funky. So you wash all that out, and I still use conditioner. Because again, even with short hair, it's important because when you use a conditioner, you're moisturizing your hair. And I step outside, my hair instantly gets frizzy, and my little hair start prickling out Using conditioner keeps everything compact so your hair stays more manageable throughout the day. Takes me to number three. I then like to scrub my face. Notice how I just have everything already in my shower ready to go? Because the whole point is efficiency. I don't want you to be in the shower for an hour. I want you to be in there for 10 minutes and step out looking like a god. So then we grab, I grab my facial cleanser, I grab my facial scrubber. The facial, the facial scrubber, it's just a mini version of the body scrubber. And what, what I like about it, same thing as the body scrubber, those little tiny bris bristles are amazing at really stripping all that dead skin in the pores. So it clears out the pores and basically every morning I'm, I'm having like a micro exfoliation session every morning my skin ends up ultra soft and I get rid of all the gunk which is why I've minimized a lot of my pimples or acne breakouts this takes me to my next step which is number four and it's manscaping now what I love about my manscape trimmer I've talked about it before it's waterproof so it stays in the shower unless I have to recharge it but the cool thing is with it I just tackle everything my arms my chest my stomach my legs my private region anything I need to get done that's when I tackle it, and I like to do so in there because it keeps everything hygienic, right? All the hair just washes down the sink, and more importantly, I can wash it off my body, so when I step out the shower, I'm looking as shredded as possible, and that's why I do this step, because when you look at yourself in the mirror, you're looking good, you look shredded, that's a good day. This takes me to step five and step six. Now I step out the shower. I've done most of the heavy lifting, took me about three to four minutes. Now I'm gonna dry up and immediately, as soon as I step out the shower, I'll do step five, which is apply a facial lotion, and then step six, apply a body lotion. These two steps are important to do as soon as you step out the shower because what you're doing is you're locking in the hydration. So all the hydration your skin has just experienced from the shower, you're locking it in. And when you do that, your skin stays as hydrated as possible all day. So now you're not walking like KD with those ashy ass ankles or ashy elbows and your skin is looking as youthful and vibrant as possible. This takes me to step number seven, apply a fragrance. Notice all of this is strategic. Every single step is done in a strategic manner because now when you apply a fragrance, now that fragrance is going to last longer because you gave it something to grab onto. It's going to sit on top of the moisturizer. Most of the time, you're applying fragrance on dry skin. So what ends up happening is because your skin is looking for hydration, it absorbs your oils and that's why your fragrances only last two, three hours and then you can't even smell them on you. When you apply it after the body lotion, you're going to smell good all day, which takes me to number eight. Now I trim and line up my beard. And I do this with two tools. I like to use my little scissors. These come from my heat grooming set. And I also use this razor pen. It's made for eyebrows, but I found that it's amazing at lining up my beard because it gives me more control than a straight edge razor. At least for myself, I'm not a barber, obviously. So with this pen, I can quickly just clean up my cheek line, make sure my beard look as sharp as possible. And then with scissors, I trim up any little fly hairs to make it seem I just got a crispy cut. Then number nine, I put on sunscreen. As right before I leave the house, the first thing I do is I put on sunscreen. Now, as a darker skin color dude, I like to use tinted sunscreen. I used to use regular sunscreen, but it would always leave this like white film haze, which I absolutely hated. Tinted sunscreen blends better with my skin, it hides imperfections, and does an amazing job of protecting your skin from the sun's harmful rays to keep your skin as youthful as possible. Then, 
I just get dressed. I get dressed and I make sure I put on an outfit that makes me feel comfortable and also good. Don't just put on something that's slop. No. Every morning, dress with intent. Dress with something that you're like, man, this looks good right now. Don't just top it off with a sloppy outfit. Do this and I promise you, you will feel better. If you're down, if you're sad right now, start doing this every day. Add the gym onto this, I promise you, your confidence and you yourself, after a year of this, you'll feel unstoppable.